Welcome to this video guys. Let's see how we can create a new virtual environment or VNV in Visual Studio Code. First of all, click on this extensions here and install the Python extension if you have not already. If you have this, you can just skip 10 to 20 seconds ahead. So let's install this. Once the installation is complete, you can just close this and your Python extension will show these options, not the install button. So now what you can do is click on terminal and click on new terminal and type this command here. So here you can see as you are already inside your project. So uh, type Python dash M V N V and then V N V or whatever name you want to give to your virtual environment. You can just call it my V N V also hit enter and a new virtual environment will be created. So as you can see, this is created here, but it is still not finished as the cursor is still here. It's not showing the directory. So let's wait for a few seconds. So now finally, as you can see the directory is shown here, this means that the creation of the virtual environment is complete. So now what you need to do is you need to activate this virtual environment and then install dependencies in this virtual environment. So first step is to activate it. How do you do this? Just type dot forward slash and then my venv and you can hit tab to auto complete and then type scr. Here notice that s is capital. Again hit tab and then activate. Again I'm hitting tab to auto complete. Hit enter. And now, as you can see, this virtual environment is activated. So now whatever you want to install, you can install in this. So you can just do pip install and then install, let's say pandas and pandas will be installed inside this virtual environment. OK, now let's finish. Let's wait for this to finish and you can close this. And what we have done now is we have created a virtual environment. We have activated it and we have installed dependencies in this virtual environment. Now, what we need to do is we need to tell our Visual Studio Code to use this virtual environment, not the global Python version. So how do you do it? So you can just click here where the version is shown and then click on enter interpreter path here. Or as you can see, it's already being shown here. So you don't need to even know, need to click this. You can just see that this my venv is being shown. That is the recommended one from here. You can just click on this and this virtual environment will be used whenever you run this Python code now. So yeah, now if I click on this run, this virtual environment will be used because it is being shown here. So this is where you, you see which Python is being used or which Python environment is being used. Now I can just click on this run and hello world will, will be printed. And to verify, you can make sure that this is the path of your virtual environment. So this python.exe is being used from inside your environment folder. So this is how you can create a new virtual environment in Visual Studio Code. If you have any questions, let me know in the comments below.